Hi, let's continue busting some myths about essential oils. I'm Sheridan Semple. I'm the owner of Aspen Holistic Health and I'm a clinical aromatherapist amongst other things. And let's talk about what can essential oils actually be used for? Someone asked that last week and, um, you know, people think, oh, they're just for making me smell awesome and my house smell awesome, but actually you can use them for your health and they can be used for anything. I mean anything that ails you. So uh, first let's start off with what I like to call the antis. So the essential oils are antibacterial, antiviral, anti-infectious, anti-parasitic, anti-fungal, right? Covers all the microbes, every little thing that you can uh, get and encounter and grow within you. It can help deal with all of that and get you back in the right place. Some essential oils are chelating, meaning they help pull heavy metals out of your cells and out of your body and chemicals and pesticides and things like that. So a lot of the essential oils can help you with your hormones. So like your thyroid, your adrenal glands, prostate stuff, all kinds of like PMS, premenstrual syndrome, uh, menstrual syndrome issues, cramping, all kinds of stuff like that. Anything hormonal, they help with brain chemistry. Some of the essential oils can actually cross the blood-brain barrier, which means they actually can go in and get nestled into the brain to help with the brain chemistry, where a lot of drugs have a problem crossing that barrier. But some of the essential oils, like frankincense, can do that naturally. They help with digestion issues. They help with respiratory system issues like skin conditions, on and on. So let's use one for an example. Blue spruce, one of my favorite oils near and dear to my heart. And here I am in front of this beautiful blue spruce tree. Check it out. Here in Colorado, the Colorado State Tree. And blue spruce essential oil specifically can help with all respiratory problems like we talked about before. So... It can help with your thyroid and adrenals in particular of your hormonal system. It can help with low back pain, right? It has natural cortisone in it. So you're going to get cortisone shots and that's chemicals. Blue spruce essential oil has natural cortisone in it. So you can use it for all kinds of like joint pain, inflammation, that kind of stuff. It, you can use it for acne, right? Crazy things. I mean, and so much more. There's so much more to this specific oil and all of the oils in general. So I'm going to keep teaching about them and get more and more. But if you want to learn more, check out the workshop I'm giving. It starts on Monday. Aspen Plants Heal locally here in Aspen. First night, we're going to talk about blue spruce essential oil and everything that it can do for you. There's so much more than what I just said here. Click on the link above to check it out and register. And um, that's it for me today. I send you off wishing you an awesome day.